Happy morning kids. Today we are going to see about the articles. That is A and an. Here we have some object. Let's name them. This is an apple. This is a chair. This is an egg. This is a mango. This is an orange. This is a pen. Why there is a before sentence name and an before certain names. Let's find the solution for the confusion. We have 26 letters in English. Out of them, only 5 letters are vowels and rest of them are consonants. And the rule is, when a singular naming word begins with the sound of the any of the vowels, then we use an before it and a singular name in word begin with the sound of any of the consonant we use a before it let's learn with the examples what is this we will say this is an apple this is a single apple so we have to use a and and before it which one is correct children we must use an apple not a apple next example what is this again this is a single object so we will use a or an before it, it start with the sound of M. So, we will choose A. And we will say this is a mango. So, we learn to use A and and before singular naming word. The word for using an is the naming word should begin with a vowel sound a word for using a is the naming word word should begin with the consonant sound let's learn more example why a banana why not an banana because banana starts with the consonant sound the sound with letter B. So we will use here before. Now what do you see in this picture? These are mangoes. We will not use A or N because the naming word is not singular. There are more than one mango. So we will neither use A or N. Instead, we will say these are mangoes. Remember children, if that is singular object, then we must use A or N. Before it, you can see an umbrella starts with vowel sound U. And we will choose an and we will say this an umbrella. Now let's see some more example. Eraser. It begins with vowel sound E. So, we will use an eraser before it. It's a pen. A P starts with the consonant sound. The sound with the P 
so we will use ear pen next this is a lunch box the letter l start with the sound of consonant so we will use ear lunch box the next we have some picture of books that is more than one book so books is the plural naming word we will neither use a or an we will say these are books we have some pictures of an apples is a plural naming word so we can't use neither a or an apples here we have a picture of laptop we have a consonant sound the sound of letter l so we will use ear laptop ear laptop it's a ball a ball begins with the letter b that is consonant sound so we are going to use ear bowl ear bowl and next there is only one cup is there and cup is starting with the sound of consonant sound so we are using a eggs it is a plural naming word here there are more than one egg so we can't use a or an with it we will say these are egg inch tape it is a single object and begins with the vowel sound the sound of letter i an inch tape you can use an a line a line begins with the consonant sound so we will use a line we have some another examples octopus a letter starting with o the sound is vowel sound so we can use only an octopus the next fan f is starting with the consonant sound a a fan another example is how will you name hour will you say a hour or an hour it begins with the letter h h is a consonant but we say hour we notice that it start with the vowel sound of a not with the sound of h so we must say an hour we must say an hour and here is the another example for you to understand this what will you use with the honest a or an will a honest or an honest start with the letter h a honest is start with the letter h but the first sound of the word is the letter o remember singular naming word with the sound of vowel not necessary the vowels will use an before it an honest person uniform this is the another example for you to understand what will you use used to the uniform a or an uniform it begins with the vowel sound u 
but it begins with the consonant sound of y we say ya uniform not an uniform okay children i hope you have understood where to use a and where to use an we can see you in the next class children take care bye